So guys, today I'll be fucking playing Roblox. Yeah, I'll do it. I'm doing my first video on Outpost 84. Ah. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, I forgot about this. Hey, look at my face. <laughs> Truly a face that only a mother could love right there. Yeah, that's the reason why I was wearing the default face, like I said at the beginning. I had a special little surprise. Yeah, uh, this is my surprise. God, I look... I look gross. I look rusty almost. It doesn't look good for me. Look, I'm just gonna try to play this game with my creepy face and a giant temperance head in the corner. And if you have any problems with that, then so be it. I honestly don't even know if I'm clicking on something or not. Like, I can go to the settings and then it's... I can't see. I can't see anything. I can't see if I'm clicking on it. I'm lucky that I could even get my skateboard out. Holy crap. All right, gamers, we are boarding. We are skate lay boarding. I've changed a few more textures than the ones that you've seen so far, and I think those will be discovered a little bit later. And also, I think that I might change a few textures on screen. Because, I mean, I didn't want to just change all the textures by myself, right? That would be lame. I only wanted to spend two hours of work before this video, not three hours. Ugh, God, I'm sorry. I hate looking at this face. It's so gross. I feel like I'm violating you just because you're watching this video and seeing this. This face is just terrifying. It's not even remotely okay. But yeah, there are other things in the game that I've changed that we may run into eventually. We may not run into eventually. Hopefully not run into eventually. The stuff that we've ran into so far is, uh... Tempest head. Tempest head level of quality, if you will. You can't really expect more than that. Oh, and you may have noticed when you look in the chat, yeah, it's all Mario Kart DS font. I don't even know why it's Mario Kart DS font. I changed the texture of everything, and I thought to myself, let's change the font, right? And so I randomly imported some fonts I chose from online, and the only one that worked was Mario Kart DS. And not only did it work, it's the only one that worked for all of them, so that's the only only font. So now if anybody wants to type in chat, they have to make it look like this. <laughs> I sure do love Mario Kart DS. I'm so glad that they finally ported Mario Kart DS to Roblox. Roblox Skate Park is the best game, and I sure do love skating and parking and Mario Kart DS. I also love looking at my, uh predator face. Look, I'm gonna be honest, it's not the most appealing face. But look at how clean these teeth are. Look at my shiny teeth in me, dude. I am absolutely wrecking the competition when it comes to dental hygiene. Destroying everybody in the field. I'm not exactly sure if my obsession with dental hygiene and probably touching children with this face is healthy or not, but I'm just going to assume that it's healthy. Until I get arrested by the cops, what I'm doing is not wrong and it, you can't prove otherwise. Nope. You you can't prove that I'm a bad guy. All I did was uh, commit several war crimes in Malaysia, including but not limited to blowing up Malaysia. That joke was directly ripped from another one of my videos. Shout out to anybody who noticed that that joke was directly ripped from another one of my videos because it was and I'm not proud. God, dude, this video is a mess already. We haven't even seen like half the textures. We haven't even gotten to the part of the video where I choose to change the textures. Believe me, there was a lot of texture change that just might happen throughout this video. I mean, as much as I love the how could the world be ready, my power is want a JPEG and want a PNG? No, it isn't. That was a trick question. All right, back to the actual game. I think that we just changed the sun into a skateboard. Oh, there's Timper's face, ready to greet us, as always. Thanks, Timper's buddy. I can always count on you. All right, moment of truth. Let's look up. There she is. It's the skateboard glistening in the light. Oh, my God. Gosh, it's barely visible. You can barely even see it. What the heck? But in this game, there is a vehicle that you can equip that matches the colors of that hot, hot skateboard. Observe the scooter. Now, this baby's known for its mad scooting. I've scooted a good three blocks in this sucker, and it's never disappointed. When the world was getting me down, I just scooted my troubles away. And now I will scoot my troubles away straight into the sun. Now, you may be asking yourself, laughability, why would you change the sun but not the moon? Now, my friend, I actually have an answer to that. As you know, I just changed the sun in front of you, so you might be a little confused. But what you didn't know is that I already changed the moon behind the scenes. Laughability has already conquered the moon god and reigns completely victorious over the sky. Live in a constant state of fear, knowing that your celestial guardians are under my control. The world will never be safe again. The world will never see the sun again. There is no sun, only babies skateboard from Build-A-Bear Workshop. A fate worse than death, truly. All right, now we're riding the scooter off into the sunset, and I'm gonna go to a game where it's nighttime. Now, being the genius that I am, I already had a game pulled up where it's nighttime. I had
had one prepared, and this is an expertly crafted game. No game is ever better than Halloween Night by none other than Derpy Studios. You know, now that I'm looking back at it, I'm willing to admit that I made a few mistakes. Maybe I went wrong when I trusted a game by Derpy Studio. Maybe I even went wrong when I changed the mood. Maybe that was overstepping the boundaries of my power. But you're about to see the consequences of my action. The second you see this moon, you will be staring directly in the face of death himself. This moon is the scariest thing that I have ever created on this channel, and you are about to witness it. Alright, let's go to Halloween night and see the moon, I guess. Who's ready to go moon watching? Yeah! Oh, yeah, there's Tempest again. He just always likes to jump scare us. Oh my gosh, it's hard to navigate this menu. Also, everything's in Mario Kart font, and I am so happy. God, I need to turn the volume down because it's copyrighted music, but I can't even select the volume! Please tell me that turned it down. I just have to try my hardest. Oh, I actually managed to do it! Oh my god! I am a genius. Now, let's look up at the moon. And... There she is. You know, sometimes I look back at my life and I regret the actions I made. Like this very screenshot of the creepy moon above me with my creepy face below it. This is art within itself, but I feel like I am abusing my power. I just can't help but feel like that I've ruined Roblox. I mean, maybe I have. Maybe this was overstepping my boundaries by admittedly a little margin. I mean, I don't want to be that guy that everybody hates because he's gone mad with power and now only cares about the moon. That is an oddly specific example, but don't look into that. I don't even feel comfortable playing this game anymore. I don't like that moon staring down at me. Here, actually, let's change the moon texture. This old moon texture? Screw you, idiot. Get out of here. Let's look up a face that all of us know and all of us are familiar with. My good friend Gaming with Kev. I love Gaming with Kev. My man is the best man in the world. Look at this smile. This smile could light up the night. Gaming with Kev is truly a beautiful beautiful man. I'm going to save this photo so his smile can truly light up the night sky. Gaming with Kev is the only man who I honor and respect in this life. No one can tell me otherwise either because I am a Gaming with Kev super fan. Look at this. I am about to turn him into the moon. Finally, Gaming with Kev is the moon. It took long... Escape to the world of anime with the Funimation app. We both subs and dubs. called Mitty Mario. I don't really have a proper name for this, but, uh, well, uh, how do I put this? Every time I do a button command, which means if I turn left and right on a video game, you're gonna hear it. Oh, God, are you gonna hear it? Let's go! like Seinfeld. Oh god, it is. <laughs> Jerry! <laughs> hey, oh, wait! <laughs> Base solo! Okay, well, oh, Jesus, hang on, wait. Oh, fuck! idea. How about we add a synth on top of the uh, the drums here? Yeah? Let's see how good this sounds. Oh god! Oh Jesus Christ! That's what we're working with. It's kind of jazzy, huh? Okay. okay. Stop it. Wait, just... Okay. Oh! We're fine. Oh! Oh god! Dog Mario? I got all the cheat codes. 
Oh, they they scream? What's this? Oh, what? Uh, and he was dead. How about we do uh, gunshot? You like I like that one? Okay. Uh, I have a, uh, a bird. <laughs> okay. Let's do, uh, oh, I, th this one sounds good. It's, it's, uh, concert, concert choir. Let's find out if it's any good. And go. The Holy Mario. <laughs> What's a space piano? What's this? Oh, dude, it's fucking in the pitch mode. Wait. Holy shit, I actually figured out how to play. I can't get enough. Hang on. <laughs> it's like the exact same thing. You guys want to go back to the Dungeons and Dragons days? The, the Renaissance days? Wait, can I do the band with Gazooie theme? Uh -huh. This one is called, uh, oh, it's a xylophone. That's the weirdest xylophone I ever heard. What the hell? Yeah, that that kind of works. Oh. You know what I want to try? You know what I want to try? I'm gonna try something stupid. I'm gonna I'm gonna sample myself. I'm gonna record something real quick. I'm gonna say, uh, how about uh, Mario? Is it gonna sound good? Let's find out. And go. Oh oh oh. Mario. 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 Thank you. It sounds like it sounds like the Satan asshole. Oh. Fuck that! I have a way better idea. I think I'm done. Uh. 
Fuck that. I have a way better idea. I have a way, 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 way better idea. You ready? Let me let me brace myself. Hang on. Give me a second. Uh-huh.
All right, old man, let me just... <laughs> okay, who... Holy shit! <laughs> you don't fuck with Link now! Hang on, let me, let me see if I can activate Turbo as well. Holy shit. All right. Fucking shit. <laughs> Unstoppable. I'm coming. I'm coming, Ganon. You better watch the fuck up, man. It actually is surprisingly playable. I don't know why, but it is. Great animation, huh? Whatever. <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? They're bringing a lot of old stuff back into Zelda. I hope the uh, Link's uh, chainsaw sword will, will make an appearance. Fuck off, Wallmaster. All right, here we go. <laughs> that was quick. Yeah. <laughs> Man, uh, awesome game's done quick. Uh, I'm only a phone call away, baby. Ah! Let's how compatible this is, huh? Here we go. Looks normal so far, yes. And here we go. Great. Oh, God damn it! Alright. Ah, I did it! Extreme intellectual. White male. With these three ultimate traits, I have obviously conquered human flirtation techniques. And I'm an official certified sex warrior. Honestly, I, I've never been rejected. Ever. Girls dig me, dude. Oh. Shit, one second. Yeah, what's up? I'm recording. You breaking up with me? My dick is perfectly long, okay? And it has a decent amount of girth. You are not breaking up with me right now. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna beat the fuck- Okay. Hi guys. I'm back. Sorry. I just had to take a quick phone call. Um... Uh, what was I talking about? Girlfriends. Girlfriends. You might be wondering. I'm also white. I feel like I'm pretty smart. I'm basically the next, you know, Elon Musk. My face is a 10 out of 10 and my dick's even better. Why can't I grab that a pussy like the Trumpster? See, this is called Elliot Roger Syndrome, a disease that continues to infect more and more of the minds of young edgelords. You probably have this as well, and I'm going to try to help you remedy the situation with a couple tactics you can try to uh, really se secure that pussy. Don't, first step, don't say secure that pussy ever. That, uh, that's only going to get you, like, locked up or something. <laughs> Man, first thing you gotta get into your head is that girls don't care about the personality. It's not about the personality, man. It's not about, you know, how, how good you groom those eyebrows. It's about the dick. Show them the dick. Measure the dick. Uh, flex those abs. And, and be a man. Pick up those groceries. Bring them into the house. Testosterone! First off, you gotta keep care of yourself a little bit, okay? You can't walk around like you've just come out of the womb. It's time to learn some hygiene, buddy. No female human being wants to smell your Barack Obama when you walk in the room subconsciously begging for some intercourse. You need to keep yourself healthy. But fuck the big corporations in the Illuminati, New World Order, Global Superhighway, Satanic Ritual, JFK, Assassination 2017, Skull and Bones, You don't need suave and dub to get yourself looking shiny and sexy. Here's a quick tip. Bathe in a mixture of 50% allium C and 50% allium sativum every night before bed and make sure to only brush your teeth with sodium hypochlorite. This way, you'll be fresher than your male opponents while they rot away their lives with fucking Old Spice. You're a young man. You don't want to be Terry Crews. You want to be buried in booze. Now, I want
want you to take a look at yourself, okay? Uh, not metaphorically. No, I don't want you to analyze your intellect or whatever the fuck you do in your free time. I want you to walk away from this computer and look at yourself in a mirror. Keep the video running while you go do that. I'm going to give you like 30 seconds. You'll be fine. Uh, hopefully you're close to one. I'll uh, run some nice music while you're gone and it'll be great, all right? You ready? Go. Go run off. Go. Go to your, go to your mirror. <clears throat> yeah, Botox? Yeah, dude, I, I hate my face. There's nothing I can do. Yeah. Yeah, I, I would like plastic surgery. The whole, the whole, the whole thing. I want the whole makeover. Eyes, nose, ears, penis. Yeah. Uh, alright. Oh, shit, hold on. I gotta get back to the video. Oh, you're back! <laughs> what? Wait, you thought I was gonna give you something after that? Uh, honestly, dude, I'm just trying to make the, the video longer for the ad revenue boost. Uh, let me think of something inspirational. Uh, the real strong have no need to prove it to the phonies. That makes you happy, right? That's right, you can be strong and attractive, just like everybody else. You know who said that? Charles Manson. Now, I know what you're all thinking, okay? You've gotten this far in the tutorial. Girl, 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 girl. I know what you want, okay? It's all about the sex. Now, sex is easy, okay? It's pretty easy to understand. The first thing you have to understand about sex is that... Another thing you gotta take into consideration is how to talk. Talk! Okay, you can't talk to a girl. You can't walk up and be like, Yo, where you live? I need to find you so I can give you one big wet kiss like a grandma would do. No one wants that shit, okay? That might get you laid, but that's not gonna get you a long-term relationship. You gotta use big words like circumlocution or osteoporosis or uh, ostentation. You gotta use big words like that, okay? Then they're, then they're gonna think you're big men, big burly men with big words, big boy words. Master the thesaurus. Uh, go outside. I'm gonna be honest with you, okay? These steps, the previous steps, they might not work for you, okay? Maybe none of the steps work for you in this video. But there's one thing that stays true, there's one thing that always works, and that's jelking. You gotta jelk, and you gotta send pictures of your dick to everyone. Everyone that you meet, okay? That's the only way to persuade people, okay? If you think, you know, your girl's being a little unloyal, maybe, uh, she, you know... <laughs>